Good morning everybody. Welcome to Charlie's Toy Box. Today we are going on adventure. As you can see, top box is gone. Got my Krieger R25 on the back. I am packed for a week. All you need is a credit card. So let's go meet up with some friends and get today's adventure started. All right, just the two of us today. Me and my buddy Tony. He's on his Ducati Desert X here in Wilkeson, Washington. I just switched over to Enduro Pro setting. I've got my brake lever for my boots, for my foot. I've got that adjusted for standing up. And I turned the traction control off. See how that goes today. Now we'll see how far we can go up today. Hopefully we can go up farther than we did about a month ago ran into quite a bit of snow <laughs> well with the traction control off you can really spin up those tires and slide around a bit With the traction control on, even an Enduro Pro, it just keeps the spin very minimal and hooks you right up. I think I'm going to turn my traction control on just so uh, I don't roost Tony. Okay, traction control's turned on. Don't need to be roosting my friend. And with the traction control on, you pick up speed a lot quicker. So on the far roads, I think that's a good setting. Come around that light turn, just a bit of throttle, it kicked out about a foot. It's a lot more, it doesn't let you go out too much further. The TC off really kick it out but like I said I don't want to be roosting my friend sit down here try to keep my speeds down never know what's coming around these corners well, today's a dry day compared to the last time we came out here we were pretty much in a mist all day all these roads were wet. Today it's all dry. And 
actually these roads being damp gave you a lot better traction so today we are exploring see where these roads lead us it's supposed to hit 71 degrees today still at 48 Temperature's not going to come till afternoon. It's only 10 13 so far this morning. I don't think we're going to break 60 till noontime. Hopefully, the sun comes out. Yeah, this dirt road is embedded with a lot of rock. It's mostly rock right under here, it's rock pack. Last time this mud hole was full of water. Didn't know how deep it was. And some jeeps running through there. Chose to stay out. Left fork. That right fork leads you to a dead end. It's a gated road. That is why I keep my speeds down. Oh, muddy, muddy. No, thank you. I think leaving the traction control will be a <laughs> help my rear tire last a lot longer. On these type of roads, traction control works out good. So this is the route Tony and I took the last time. And it's also the route that I pre-planned on the uh, BMW Connected Ride app. Waterfall right there. With all this coverage, sometimes the GPS goes wacko. So it's not showing the trailer right now. It's circling all around there. All right, what's going on here? Oh, boys are out here shooting, getting some practice in. Good for them. spots up here where people come and shoot all right if I remember right we go left here okay if I go right the way I planned yeah that brings us that rock that was one of the routes to the right that gets all rocky and it narrows down and gets boulders so staying away from there and going this way oh, looks like I planned both routes so we took the left which is a smarter way to go otherwise we'd be done right away Get another hundred yards up there
so far the biggest obstacles on this fire road potholes every now and then you gotta watch out for a branch up above you so you don't smack your head when you're standing my younger self would like to pin it through these roads and pray there's nothing coming around the corner I think I've gotten a little bit smarter as the decades have gone by just not, not as f much fun though hmm. So this is a spot where we had all that snow last time. Stop here for a sec. Well, hey. Here the last time. I hope I didn't roost you. It's okay. I, I, you know, when you said, I didn't realize you said we were going shooting. I thought you said we were going riding, but we were going shooting. <laughs> Oh man, I'm sorry about. Uh, I, I, okay. It'll make cool video. You know, the the last time, I, even though I'm on Enduro Pro, it does have traction control. So when I do get on it, it'll only go out a little bit. Well, and I can follow further behind you. But part of the reason why I was to the side a lot of times. Well, when we hit that road to start to go up, I said, "Yeah, I wonder how much difference it makes when I turn off the traction control." So I hit my traction control switch off. It fucking just spun. <laughs> Do, nope. Just further back if I need to. No, I put the traction control back on because on these type of roads, especially with the drive, this it does really well. We're not in the situations that you're better off with the traction control I off. Rear ABS off. I found that that off is much better because then you can see it. Yeah, yeah. See on my Enduro Pro settings, I've got it's got a limited, just a light traction control, and then front ABS, and then no ABS on the rear. Yeah. And then I could turn the traction control on and off by the switch. So I'm leaving it on that way. I'm not spinning so much. And it gives you better tire life. Yeah. <laughs> so it's got us going that way. And this is where we ran it. This is where we turned around. Until we run out. And then we'll, uh, we'll switch if we need to. <laughs> this is where we stopped last Yeah. Time. Yeah. This is where all that snow was. So we're going up further. Let me just fix. Get, oh, this thing's already. Okay, never mind. It's, it's where we're at. Okay. I yeah, I saw this and I'm like, wow, all the snow's gone. This is awesome. 